She is the funniest goat. <laughs> she wants to be held like that. <laughs> Lydia, she gives us little notes like this because she doesn't like spiders. Let's see. Ooh, that is a pretty good wolf spider. We'll leave it right here for when she goes to the bathroom. If you promise not to take my shoes anymore, I'll let you come in, okay? Pinky promise. Yeah, you're still gonna take them. No, I'm making it pretty. Okay, that's fancy goat's goat. Goat milk is in it though. I'm trying to make something amazing. You'll see. Okay. You just like cut like a pizza. What kind of uh, scones? Yeah, what kind of scones? Cherry almond. Ooh. I'm gonna come uh, come with you guys, so hold on, let me get this in the oven. A little bit of sugar on top. Oh yeah. He's just being nice and milking for you? No, he owes me, because I milked for him while he played last night. So yesterday we spent all day picking up leaves and cleaning up the yard, and then we realized there's no way we're gonna be able to do that. So I think we're gonna hire somebody to come out and run over the whole yard with a lawnmower and clean it all up, because these leaves, man, when you have like four trees that are like 20 years old, man, leaves everywhere. Tilly, your strap came off again. Gonna leave it off. I think we should just leave it off. I'm a little nervous that her cast will come off, but. Oh, I'm so worried it's gonna come off. Oh my gosh, Doris. That's, That's no what... shit. Doris. Doris. Leave her alone. You can't help her when she has a cast. <laughs> That's so mean. It is mean. <clears throat> Be nice. I was telling you guys yesterday that I feel like Doris is uh In heat is again? no I think so she's just like becoming the alpha or the oh, queen. Oh, no. Uh oh. Doris, she's naughty. Why did you have to go and break your leg? Causing all sorts of problems. How are her horns? They're so tiny. Well, she, <laughs> she's a pretty small girl. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> she runs like that, yeah. Oh! She doesn't really hold back her milk. She's just like naturally, it, she feels full, but she's not. Mm. Kind of like Luna was. Yeah. All right, here you go. Oh, those holes, so she doesn't fall enough? Yeah, I felt bad. She's falling, she's gonna break her leg. I don't want two goats with broken legs. <laughs> and it's a baby goat. Yeah, there's these three holes, and I'm thinking if I just break to the side. Oh, it fell in. Oh dang, I was hoping, no, get away. No. Oh, she's gonna eat it. <laughs> Go down the slide, bye. All right, I'm gonna let it fall in. Maybe we need to have, maybe what can we plug it with? What can we plug it with? All right, I figured it out. Okay, so I stuffed a pine cone in the holes and then I um, filled it the rest with foam. But that means that while it's drying, we get a little helper this morning because she keeps walking over there and I'm afraid she's going to eat it. It's like bringing a toddler with you. That can't talk and walk with You want to come run with me? Step in the mud, you go <laughs> That's Hello. okay, that's what happens when you take a toddler with you on your farm chores. We need to get her like goat boots. No, let her run around and it'll dry off. I'm going to go check on the scones. I'll be right back. We'll put this on there until it dries. That's okay, just leave it like that. All right. All right. You're good. Here's the thing. Where does it go? 
Uh, on the fence. How is that going to work? <laughs> Somewhere. Uh, like, I don't know. We have to We have to choose which level we think that they can. I think I, I just said which. Here. But Okay. Or no, wait. Yeah, uh, vertically here. challenged goats. No, oh, maybe that's too low. Or that's good. Okay, that's probably good. I think that's good, right? Oh, all right. She's like, oh. Do you oh. think her nose will fit in there? Yeah, they can put their tongue. They have long tongues, too. But what about Luna's big old fat nose? She has a long tongue. Made out of schedule 80, <laughs> 100 PSI, never These go break. are the most heavy duty Come. mineral feeders in existence. Go ahead, try it. Step on it. Okay, just choose one. Step on it right there. Do you think that those hooks will hold it? We'll see. Okay. All right, Liddy, get us started. Look, this is the beauty of it. You can stay on that side. Oh, that is Oh, beauty. snap. Yeah. Ready? Okay, go. Or do I have to? Oh, I don't know, honey. It's coming, it's coming, it's coming. Quit going on there. there. Don't look there, no, don't no. look there. There, there you go. Put your nose in the nose Close hole. It. Where's the club? Where's the lady then? The nose hole. Hey, look. They want it, guys. <laughs> put it in the other one. They Luna, like it. Where's your big nose? Luna. Okay, put it, Ethan, put it in there. Luna. She's more concerned with the new hay. Oh my gosh, they're so excited. This makes me so happy. <laughs> I love that they're as excited about this as I am. They will get out of here. <laughs> Baking soda. This works really well. It does. And it only cost a million dollars and took us like all day. A $200 uh, <laughs> goat feeder. It will, wasn't 200, we'll but it was definitely, it wouldn't have been as expensive if we wouldn't have got such heavy duty pipe. pipe. Yeah. <sighs> See, well, does she like it? Does her nose fit? Her big nose. Luna. She doesn't even care. Oh my gosh, Luna! <laughs> they're not going to be as interested in the baking soda. It doesn't taste good. Yeah, look. They're just like, no. It's oh, healthy. that is so cool. Look, they love the kelp. Look at that. Oh, they do. Oh, that's awesome. I guess I should probably kind of explain what we are feeding them here. One is just a basic mineral blend. It's the Redmond Goat Mineral Blend. And then this next one that Doris is obsessed with is kelp. It's just a really good source of chlorophyll and other trace minerals. And then we've got the uh, baking soda. Oops, baking soda. That one is more like a medicine for the goats if they feel bloated or an upset stomach. It can help neutralize the acidity. Oh, she's trying. Oh, she just saw that we looked at her. <laughs> okay, don't say anything. Do it. <laughs> Mom, you're slippery. You did it. She, oh. oh. All right, so uh, we need to move that one over here. And we need to get rid of this ugly blue one because we can't have blue stuff that's ugly. Only metal or cool wood. Meanwhile, Ethan and Luna. <laughs> She's so weird. Willow! <laughs> that was the best. Ready, go. Ready, set, go. Oh, she ran the other way. The only last thing I want to do is put both dog moves, like boom and boom. Because I don't want to use it as part of the playground. Feeders. It makes me so happy to have them all heavy duty and organized. In the time that we've owned goats, we've probably had 10 different mineral feeders break. And so I was determined this time we're going to have mineral feeders. They're gonna be so heavy duty, they're gonna survive the apocalypse. Like there will be roaches, and then there will be my mineral feeder. Yeah. That is gonna be alive, right, Ethan? Mm -hmm. I'm determined. Her eyes are like looking two different directions. <laughs> she don't want to go to sleep. She likes to be held like this. She does. Willow. All right, well, Lydia's just going to rock Willow to sleep now, you guys. So she is the funniest goat. And she wants to be held like that. <laughs> Wake up. Okay. Oh my gosh. Here, I just want to show how cool it is that our backyard is all picked up. Look at you guys, the whole thing is mowed. The leaves are all gone. Now we're ready for the pond. Yes. 
pond, yay! So we've got one more week till the pond is gonna start. We've just been really busy trying to really clean up the yard. We were fixing goat fencing, fixing the chicken coop, because during the two to three weeks when the pond's getting built, we're gonna have to lock all the animals up in their cages, even the chickens in the coop, so that we can open up all of this fencing and have all the trucks brought in, all the boulders brought in, and it's gonna be insane. So stick with us and it'll be a fun adventure. Rip them suckers out. Janelle will never come out here when there's bees. Out. No, you guys, there's bees out here every day in my garden eating all my broccoli flowers and I've been letting them. But I don't want to pull them out during the day. I keep forgetting to pull them out because every time I come out, I'm like, I'm not going to touch them. There's like a thousand bees on them. <laughs> you know, I try to be brave when a bee's around me, but. Janelle does attract more bees than anyone. I do. I have like actual documented video evidence that I'm not gonna show where bees attack me more than other people. I think it's probably just because I'm, I smell amazing. Or at so least she I thinks they're now. attacking her because she does move they around are. a lot like she's getting attacked, but who knows if she actually no. is. No, they are. They're getting me. It's horrible and I feel like I'm gonna die. So when people ask like, hey, are you guys gonna get bees? I'm like, Sorry to disappoint. Yeah, if you just pull them out, then tomorrow I can come in here and work the soil. Look how awesome the soil looks. Look at that. Oh it's just been so covered by all these plants, oh, so all the bug cute. life has been really active. We just have to put away that uh, little greenhouse thing back there, because it's kind of oh. an eyesore. Do a little bit more cleanup back with the goats, and then we'll start taking down all the fencing. Yay, look, see now, see guys, look. Look what I can do. I can sit right here, are you ready? Watch. You guys know this seat of my garden? It's like the back corner of my garden, okay? Bam! And see the pond. And once this fencing is all gone, I can walk straight through those little boxes right here and walk right out to the pond. Oh. Unless there's a bee. Unless there's a bee, in which case I'll be undercover in that shed over there. Hey guys, it was another awesome day on the farm. Feels good, because you know me, I love cleaning up and I love organizing. We've got our new mineral feeders that work amazing. They're gonna survive till the end of time. So it's good. called cleaning up. It's called throwing away everything yep. that we own. That's what you do. All right guys, we're gonna go in and hang out with the fam and hope you guys have a great night. We'll see you later. Yeah. Bye.